Hey world, it's your boy Big Chips. Listen, today I want to talk to you a little bit about just stuff going on in the industry, stuff going on with people, and uh, you know, the problem with everything is we want to blame everybody for our problems and everybody for things that go wrong in our world except for the person who's actually responsible for it, and that is you and me and the person <laughs> that's in that situation. You know, and I think the thing that people just never think about is the fact that you control your own destiny with your thoughts. You control everything in your life with what you're doing inside of your business and inside of your career because it's all you. The products are the same for everybody. The opportunity and compensation is the same for everybody. So it's not that. So what is the only difference in the situation? And that's you, right? Yeah, so I'll help you with the hard ones. All right, so then you got people who are being terminated from their accounts and their money being stripped away. So now people are you know, crying foul and you know, I'll call the attorney general and all this other stuff. Well, here's the problem, number one. Number one, you start calling the attorney general on one, you're gonna start poking fingers at all. So just because you're mad and you did something wrong, you shouldn't be doing stuff like that. If you wanna seek legal counsel over some stuff, seek some legal counsel. But here's the problem, when you break the rules, the rules are there for a reason, right? So the whole point of being paid as an IBO or as an independent distributor is that you follow all guidelines, that you do what they tell you to do. And if you don't do that, then you can and will be terminated. All right, so simple, simple enough for that. So what happens if you're terminated from your, from your company? Well, they don't have to pay you. All right, the rules clearly state in almost every single company out there, if you are not an active distributor with no marks, no penalties, no, you know, just nothing wrong, you followed the rules like you're supposed to do, you will get paid. If not, if you are terminated, you lose all rights to that company. That means your rank, your pay, everything. It does not matter. You can seek legal counsel, you can fight it out in court, and you know, whatever it is you think you wanna do or need to do, I mean, all power to you, it's your money. I mean, I lost a large chunk of income, and I've never once blasted the company public. I've never once blasted the person who was responsible for it. I never, I never did that, because that's not, you know, that's not what I do. If I were to blast you online, it's because you speak my name publicly. Those who speak my name behind closed doors, you know, I know you're gonna get yours. I'm not worried about it. it it's no skin off my back. People are gonna hate, haters are gonna hate. That is just what happens. But if you are gonna speak my name on a public forum and you're going to speak, you know, truth, that's fine, speak truth. If I say something, you can prove it, prove it. I don't care. Because if I say it to you, I'm going to say it to anybody. That's just the way I am. But that's the only reason for that for me. But as a whole, you know, what happened in my situation, you know, wasn't necessarily right. There's a lot of illegal things that happen in that situation. And should I try to rectify the situation, I, I could win. But how much money am I going to spend on it? You know, and how much money that I claim I've lost <laughs> is really going to be worth my time. You know, so I don't. I, I shut the heck up and I go build. You know, I don't sit here and go tit for tat with every single situation. I just shut my mouth and I go build my company. You know, everybody's screaming multiple opportunities, single opportunities, whatever opportunities. It doesn't matter what you do. All right, if you have multiple opportunities, all power to you. If you only have one, that's great too. You know, I'm not hating, I'm not discriminating, I'm not saying anything against it because I have my hands in a few pots, you know, but here's the difference. I brand me, all right? I brand big chips. I brand who I am and my brand 
is helping people to succeed. If one company is not their cup of tea, then I I look to where it might be their cup of tea. I look to where they might actually want to go and succeed. You know, if they've already been in my company, but they want to work with me and I have another secondary situation, it's there. You know, but I don't train. Now, I do mention Wake Up Now a lot. I do wear the brand. That's true. But at the same time, I don't spend my life just doing that. I'm not an executive yet. I'm not signing a document that says I'll be a trainer for that company. I just train network marketing. That's it. You know, I train people how to succeed, and I help people to succeed, no matter what company you're in. So it doesn't matter really what you do, just do it ethically, all right? Don't be somebody that goes out there and cross promotes other people's teams. Don't go out there and try to use your downline to move to a new company. And sure as heck don't go blasting the company when they terminate you for doing illegal crap. You know, just use your head, guys, use your head. Don't, don't blame it on everybody else. Blame yourself and figure out how you can change the situation next time. How can you be better? All right. So that's the name of the game is being better. So that's it. That's my Saturday rant. I got another video that I cut. I got to edit it and put it up. You know, I'm going to break down some uh, marketing stuff. So I'll probably put it in this video once I actually get it up. So if you're watching this, you can see it. But uh, until then, it's your boy Big Chips representing the Diamond Dream Team. Listen, this is your world. This is your business. This is your life. Dare to make it great. All right? Make it a great day. I dare it.